Yo, what's up everyone? Welcome back, Jamie here today with Dylan, and we're gonna be ranking the Evil Dead franchise from worst to best. And before we start, like, even with Rise as well, like, this franchise, there's not any bad films, really. Like, there's some better than others, but overall, like, Hellraiser, for example, or, like, Chucky and stuff, you know. Oh, 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 I like Nightmare on Elm Street. Oh, yeah, well, depending on your taste, I guess, but... We're gonna class the... Obviously, we're gonna have Evil Dead Rise in this, and we're gonna include the TV show as well, which... You know, it's kind of hard to judge the TV show compared to a film, but at the same time, I guess we've got to include it, haven't we? Yeah, we're, we're including it as, like, the show, not, like, per season. Yeah, just the three seasons straight up, yeah. Let us know your list down as well inside the comments. So, we got... I think we both have the same number six, so I'll just go with it. Number six, Evil Dead Rise. <laughs> Rise, baby! Pop, pop! Yeah. If we did our review, check that out if you want to hear our like in-depth thoughts, but we weren't really hyped for this going into it anyway, were we, to be honest? No, which was really weird, because maybe it was because of like, it was 10 years ago, we were so hyped about the re- like, well, tw 2013, 2013 yeah. Evil Dead, which, you know, actually reached our expectations, I think, you know, we very much enjoyed True. that. But yeah. Again, like, it is, it, it is that thing where it's like, this one we were just, we weren't hyped for, we felt. But then again, we like before the thirteenth one, we had nothing before it. You know what no. I mean? We didn't have the TV show. So once we had the TV show, we're like, well, there's things, there's characters, there's storylines, there's stuff that you can bring into a movie. But you know, it is what it is. Yeah, we won't go too spoiled in case people haven't seen it. If you want to see our in-depth thoughts, like I said, we did the review. But I mean, like we're ranking them, but it's not. It's like the worst film I've ever seen. It's average film. It's just you know, compared to the others, it's it's you know, it's yeah, average like. Slucky horror movies of modern day. Yeah, true. Let's make up it. Yeah, um, don't hit me on this one. Again, it, it's not because it's bad, but because I think last of it's because it was so great. The original Evil Dead. Same here. Same. I think I'd like it more if, like, if that was the only film. There was never like a number two or anything. Yeah. I'd like yeah. it more, but you know. Yeah, but it's it, it, it's it's one of those rare cases where the where the first one in the franchise is not the best. Not that so, it's the worst, but it's like it's not the best. You know what I mean? Like, you, yeah. You, Evil Dead Two just does it much better. Exactly. Really so again, like, and it's such a good movie, you know. And like, didn't we review this one like a year yeah, ago? We or so? did. Yeah, we did. So, everything, you know, yeah. I don't know how much more in depth we can go in, really, without no. We do we hashing. But our main problem, Ash isn't Ash in the film, is it? Obviously, it's the character Ash, yeah. but not as we know him until. Yeah, he's like, not as he's know. normal. So it's like those early days, but like there are traits of him there, like he, he brave without. Without the obvious tropes being brave, you know what I mean? He's just, you know, he, he's fearless, like, with, with a stupidity. I was just thinking, what's the, do you remember the first Evil Dead you saw? Because for me, it was number two, so maybe that's... I think it was song. two, that, I, yeah. I'm positive it was, because, like... Well, maybe I, if we, like, if we saw this one first, we'd probably like it more, but if we saw, I we saw I don't, number two I don't first, think so. so. I, I think, you know, the, the, I think a lot of people say two's the best. Like two is one. Yeah. Not, not spoiling anything. Not giving away any numbers. Yeah, not spoiling either. anything. No. Number four for me is twenty thirteen. Yep. Evil same. Dead. Yeah. Evil Dead. Twenty thirteen. Like, what more can we say about this? Like, we we loved oh, it. Yeah. We loved we it. Absolutely loved it. Characters like not just me or Eric as well. Like Eric's the tank. Eric. It's so brutal as it was, well. Obviously, it was, her name was Mia, wasn't it? The, 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 yeah, Mia. Yeah. Me and Eric like the ones I think. Like, the others were, were were interesting, but they were just fodder. You know what I mean? Yeah. The like, brother was the brother as Ash at first, one they, but then yeah. you know they went away with that, so that was decent. So it was really... I just feel like twenty thirteen just did it much better than Rise. It just feels like Rise was just like you know, it's just a repeat in a way. Twenty thirteen, it was just yeah, oh all. my god, too many calls. Yeah. Like, that's the good thing about Evil Dead twenty thirteen as well, like. I mean, it was a few callbacks, I guess, but it wasn't on the nose like Rise, where it's just like, oh, yeah. you remember this? You remember this? All right, don't hit me on this. You know, I'm a, I'm a, different, I'm a different breed. I'm a different guy. Oh, right, here we go. Number three is Evil Dead 2. Oh, right. Our list is going our separate ways. This, this, is, where, I think this is where we diverge past. This is you know, yeah, timeline is. Like, don't get me wrong. I love it. Great. But I'm over, you know, as you'll know by the next two, I'm more of a comedy guy. You know what I mean? I love the, the humor more than anything. But again, like, you know, I was struggling to, you know, where to place that. This is to be fair with these final three, you can't really go wrong with any of them, really, can you? They're all I know. great. They're all great. Like I yeah. wouldn't argue with anyone's placement because at the end of the day, I'd have to go. Well, that's personal choice. For me, I've got the TV show Ash vs Evil Dead because, like, you said, combined gotcha. the three seasons into like our opinion yeah. here. But I'd say like ninety percent of the episodes are great. There's a few like you know 
Yeah, but then yeah, again, yeah, you're not. Yeah. Yeah. The story of the characters are great as well. There's yeah. a few I don't really like, but Ash vs. Evil Dead, man. Like you said, it came out after 2013, and it just proved, like, you know, you could still do it. Unfortunately, yeah. you know, the star situation, no one watched it and all that, and, you know, only if you had that Netflix deal a few years, you know. But still, the TV show is so good. I love it. And that was a major issue, but, yeah. And again, it's hard to sort of, like... The TV show is sort of an unfair advantage, because three seasons, like, what, what were they, like, 30 minutes... A forty yeah, minute an episode. episode. Yeah, it's like eight episodes a season. Yeah, so, you mean? Yeah. so you've got like what two movies per season ideally, you know what I mean? Like two like you know, two hour movie per season roughly. Yeah, it's or, a lot like, more content in it. You know what I mean? There's a lot more content, a yeah. lot more character development. So it's really it's unfair, but like it, you've got to do it. I mean it's part of the franchise. If if you read the comics they'd be in here too at some point. <laughs> I'll go with my number two because I know we disagree on this one. Army of Darkness is my number two. <laughs> but like with these final two, you can't go right. You just like you said, it's personal nope. choice. Like Army, Army of Darkness is my number two. Is it? All right, then, then we're back on track. What? So Army of Darkness is number two for you? Yeah. I thought it would be the first one for you. No, 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 no. Obviously. Oh, okay. That's that's a surprise. But yeah, Army of Darkness. <laughs> We've met in a crossroads. <laughs> yeah, we have. I was not expecting that. Like, Ash is fully Ash in this, and oh, it's just complete yeah. comedy. But it's just so funny. It's it really like, is. This is like the pinnacle. But again, he's it's like I say, like Ash is not brave. He's too stupid to be afraid. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like he's and he's overconfident in this point. You know what I mean? Yeah, he's, true. He, and he's, and he's with, out of his element as well. He's in the past, like you know, all these people have no idea what he's talking about. Like, like. He, he's a jerk hero. You know what I mean? True. Yeah. He's, he's the guy who he will save your life, but he's not gonna be your you know happy Superman flight and all that. But yeah, I could watch this. I'll never get tired of this film, no matter how many times I watch it. No matter what. You know what I mean? And just oh, the way it looks, the way it is. Oh my god, it's so good. So, you must go with your number one. I mean, I've guessed what it is, but... It's oh, well, we kind of know. <laughs> well, it's Ash vs. Evil Dead, okay? And, again, like, it has the unfair advantage of, like, just... Yeah, true. ...character development and, and, and long storytelling. And, you know, like, for most of the franchise, it's Ash that you, you're following. There's no real, necessarily recurring character other than Ash. No. And, you know, not even, not, even in a, not even in a sense the Deadites are recurring, because they're always possessed by someone else. I guess the only one is Henrietta, really, but that's just, you know. Yeah, I can just say that. So, like, so you've got Pablo, you've got a. Uh, oh, fuck, Pelly, Ruby. Yeah. You know, you've got all that. She's daughter, I don't mind. Yeah, She's I don't mind. Character. You know what I mean? Like, it's a lot better than it did Kelly, I think. You know what I mean? I thought that was a lot better, though. That would be. You've got yeah. all stuff like that. And it's 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 got the humor, it's got the gore. You know, that first episode being directed by Sam Marini, I feel like it was a real strong point for the show. I mean, they, they, they shot yeah, out. They kicked it off right, didn't they? Yeah, that was the right way to do it. You no, know, the, the car, the trailer, the, like his little gecko, like, animal he has, like, he's always got to do. <laughs> I mean, and again, it's, it's, it's Ash, like, he's, he's saved the world, but, like, he's going to do it his way, you know what I mean? He's, he's not going to do it, like, the right way. He's going to fuck it up, and he'll yeah. come out. You know what I mean? And for me, number one's Evil Dead 2, because, like, the perfect mix of comedy and horror, and it's just, you know... Again, it can't be wrong. You can't be wrong no, with it. Like, can't be wrong. And I agree, action. like, you know what I mean? Like, it, it was a hard one, but I prefer comedy, and these two will lead more towards that. True, yeah, but... Yeah, like I said, either one of them three, like, I would not complain any time watching them. Even the TV show, I'd just go through it. I won't care, it's, you know, so entertaining. Yeah. It is, and I feel like it's one of those rare TV shows that... Well, you, if, you, if you're a deep fan of the show, you could probably start at any moment of the show and enjoy it. I mean, you could pick up like yeah, half of through season two and, you know what I mean, you'd enjoy it. But you have to be like a hardcore evil, you have to be an evil dead, but you, have to not, you have to be into evil dead, you know what I mean, to really do that. Our friends would get it from the beginning, you know what I mean? Hmm. But yeah, like I said at the beginning, this, you know, the franchise is still strong. I wasn't a big fan of Evil Dead Rise, but it's still a decent film, so I'd say like, it's not a bad film, really, is yeah. there? You know, it's still going strong. My, my hope is that Evil Dead Rises keeps, you know, like it, I hope it doesn't become an anthology series. You know what I mean? Like yeah, that's Halloween. My worst. Yeah, that's why I don't want it. To Halloween, happen. Halloween was meant to be that, and I hope that that doesn't come because, because I feel like oh, it's the Necronomicon in a different location, and they just keep doing that, and it's like because yeah. it needs to be a recurring sort of creature or thing that you know keeps us, you know, like you know, to the that's the third Nightmare on Elm Street. You're coming back for, for Freddy. 
yeah true i understand like people like oh well ash don't want to play it. but like i said in the review like just like you just said in the tv show there's three characters right there or oh, create yeah. a new character and keep them coming back like you know just and bring me a back with, you know yeah bring me a back yeah exactly have, well, bring introduce me with pablo and see he can create her over and boom oh, yeah, baby yeah, there we go yeah that's a good idea that, yeah but let us know your uh, list down below inside the comments. Like and subscribe if you're new. Check out the social links down below. Until next time, peace out in a bit.